kvantfüüsikas ei ole objektik kindlad asjad, need on võimalused. Võimalused, mille vahel saab teadvus valida. Kas saame rääkida Jumalast läbi teaduse, mis pidevalt analüüsib ja tandab kõike asjadeks? Jumal peaks olema suur tervik. Kuidas saab rääkida Jumalast üldse läbi teaduse ja veel vähem leida sellest tõestust? This evolutionary step is completely essential for even basic survivability of human beings on this planet. We have literally managed to train whole generation of kids on the idea that everything is material. Elame maailmas, kus suur osa teadusest nõuab, et maailm piirduks selle füüsiliste mõõdetavate aspektidega. Müstikud aga ignoreerivad suures osas teaduse rolli ja püüavad maailma selgitada ainult vaimsuse kaudu. On haruldane, et ühendatakse teadus ja vaimsus. Hea võimalus oli näha Eestis maailmas tunnustatud kvantfüüsikud doktor Amit Kosvamit. Eestiga seob teda Lille Linnma, kes peab loengud ja on konsultant doktor Amit Kosvami asutatud kvantülikoolis. Siin võiks öelda, et ekstrasensid ja teadlased teevad lõpuks ometi koostööd. If you hear the message of quantum physics, then all you have to do in order to see that there is evidence for God in the science that we are doing now is to recognize that, well, how is God related to consciousness? That's all you need to know. There is very definitive scientific evidence for the existence of God. And then my question to you, so what are you doing about it? Well, the, the fundamental work that I did is still the most important work um, in my view. The fundamental work that I did was to interpret quantum physics in a paradox-free way. And uh, this uh, brought in Heisenberg and von Neumann's vision uh, into proper paradox-free manner in a way that consciousness becomes the fundamental um, uh, being of reality. Uh, that to me was very important because um, not only does it give quantum physics its paradox-free interpretation, but it establishes a genuine theory of something that has eluded us for 5,000 years. Namely, is there a science behind consciousness? You know, the basic thing that it's about, about ourselves that we noticed ever since we learned to speak and we are not a baby anymore is that we experience things, we talk about ourselves as an I, and we obviously are enchanted by this I and what it does. And yet, you know, one of the things that I was always surprised, that we pay so much attention to physics, chemistry, and biology, but we don't really pay any attention to understanding consciousness. Kusvami kirjutab oma uuemas raamatus kõigi vastuste raamat, et oleme jõudnud aega, et ühendada teadus ja vaimsus. Kui käsitleda vaimsust ja teadus tasakaalus, pakub see uut laadi võimalus kõigile ja kõiges. Kvantfüüsika annab selleks parimad võimalused.